it's really important to remember that opioid addiction is a disease that can be treated. And like every other disease, it's important to understand the patient's prescription history. We as prescribers have a vital role to play in making sure that we're prescribing safely and effectively each and every time. Fortunately, we have a, a great tool available to us that can help us navigate the choices that we're facing as clinicians when we're prescribing controlled substances. The CURE system allows us to query a database that is maintained by the Department of Justice of every controlled substance across the state. So if we're thinking about prescribing a controlled substance like an opioid, we can actually see the history for that given patient in terms of who else might have prescribed to that patient. The CURES database really has come into its own um, in the past couple of years. In particular, now we have a newer version, which is much more user friendly. And as a result, I think more physicians and more prescribers are, number one, aware of the fact that this exists. And number two, as they start to um, delve into it, are starting to see some more clinical value to it. CURES has undergone a major reboot um, and we're in CURES 2.0. Um, some of the added functionality is that there is a communications portal that allows physicians who are prescribing to communicate with one another directly through the CURE system. Another is that the registration process is a lot easier now than it used to be. A new CURES 2.0 will allow uh, clinical staff to be registered and run reports for the clinician to make their practice even more seamless. That's extremely valuable and a time saver. Using cures to review a patient's prescription history can trigger conversations with the patient, with their other providers, and when needed, referrals to substance use disorder treatment. The CURES database to me actually represents a springboard for conversation with my patients. I um, use the CURES report regularly. Um, for me, being an inpatient psychiatrist, I am generally dealing with people who have comorbidities of mental illness and substance use disorders. And the CURES report allows me to look at the prescription drugs that may be worsening these diagnoses. CURES is uh, extremely valuable as a tool leading up to a patient encounter. If a patient has arrived and I see that they have back pain for three months, I can look in my chart, I can run a CURES report, and if I see they haven't had any prescriptions in my system or elsewhere, that really can inform my interaction with them. We print out a patient report for, say, the last six months. It'll show me all the controlled substances prescribed by which clinician, which pharmacy they were filled at, what quantity, and what that allows me to do is really add a sense of safety in knowing that a patient isn't doctor shopping and doesn't have a copious amount of opiates or other controlled substances. By using cures, we know that we're gonna be able to prescribe more safely to our own patients to improve the health of our community and save lives.